Just for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. For Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. I do appreciate all my Aries is out here. For my cross watchers, this energy can be resonated. So just be a little aware that as you're tuning in. So someone seeking spiritual guidance right now. You could even be a tarot reader and do a tarot card yourself. I'm seeing a lot of you running out the goal right now. Looks like the universe has a gift to offer Aries. This is a fresher perspective on your vision ahead. Meditation is going to bring you to this point for a lot of my Aries is out here. I am seeing stability come in for you for those of my Aries that are lacking stability right now. You know, of course, sacred energy resonates and leave with us and for somebody else. My name is the Reader the Million Dollar Terror for those of you that are new and welcome to the Million Dollar Channel. Let's see what else we got for Aries. We got the truth coming out. We got trust. This is going to cause you to trust someone once you learn the truth. We got forgiveness. Somebody is wanting forgiveness from Aries. You could be wanting forgiveness from Aries. Aries could be wanting forgiveness from you. A lot of you are trying to heal right now. But it looks like in order to heal, you have to look in the mirror and figure out what's wrong. This is going to take looking within yourself for a lot of my Aries. Is seeing somebody compassionate coming in. We got the rebirth. This is for my a ch Aries chance for my Aries to show themselves in a different light. I'm getting a lot of you haven't shown yourself in the best light. So this is kind of a chance to start over for a lot of you. What's coming in for Aries? Somebody's dealing with Gemini having history. This could be a Sag, a lot of Sag energy. Somebody could have an 11 year old, maybe 13, you could be 28. Somebody could be dealing with an Aries, somebody could be 32. This could be another Aries for some of you. We got some Taurus energy. Somebody could be dealing with a Taurus, somebody could be 26. This could be a Leo for some of you, somebody could be 23. We got a lot of Leo energy showing up. We got the naked self and love and trust in yourself. So for a lot of my Aries, is this is learning to love something about yourself that you hated at one point. I'm seeing you comparing yourself to the old you. I'm seeing a lot of my Aries is comparing the old them to the new them. Continue to make that progress. Um, I am seeing a little gossip, a little chitter chatter. Somebody is talking about Aries. This could be your sex life. Maybe somebody that you have a sex with. They could be talking to others about it. Could be out sharing the tales of love and romance. Or this could be in a good way. This could be somebody expressing how much love they have for Aries. This could be a Gemini for some of you. You know, take what energy resonates, of course, and leave what does it for somebody else. This could be a Cancer. We, this could be a Libra for some of you. Somebody could be dealing with a Cancer or a Libra. Somebody could have a two-year-old, maybe not. We got believing your beauty and the truth behind an illusion. So for a lot of my Aries, especially for those of you that feel like something just isn't right, you could be onto something here, especially if you're dealing with a Libra, you know. Take what energy resonates and leave what doesn't for somebody else, especially for those of you that are dealing with a Libra. We got spiritual goddess and route of Aries. We got self-reward. We got dream work. Somebody could be 21, dealing with someone 21. We got confidence. Somebody can have a 12 year old. So for a lot of my areas is in order to be able to even reach the self reward that the universe is sending for you. You got to have confidence in your craft and what you do. Somebody can have a living room. Somebody can have a 17 year old. We got decisions. This decision is going to be to choose yourself. We got self healing. So for a lot of my areas, you got a big important decision coming up. This is choosing yourself. Purifications. This is getting that spiritual cleansing. Somebody needs a spiritual cleansing. Once you purify yourself, we got prosperity ahead of you. Somebody got an eight year old, maybe four, maybe six, maybe 11. Somebody could be 38. I'm seeing you going on a journey. This journey is going to transform you. Somebody could be 34. Dealing with someone 34. I do appreciate all my Aries is out here once again. Thank you for tuning in. It's a lot of harmony and sexual chemistry between you and another Aries. Some of you are dealing with another Aries right now. I'm seeing a lot of harmony, a lot of chemistry. You understand each other. But there could be a third party situation going on here. This could be with an Aquarius for some of you. Could be a Libra. Somebody could be dealing with a Libra, have a history. That could be a Libra third party. So it looks like you're going to be getting the truth about an Aquarius or a Libra. Some of you are going to decide to walk away from a Libra because of temptation. I don't know if this is you ending the connection. I don't know if this is this Libra. It looks like the truth is going to come out about an Aquarius or a Libra. 
when it comes to a third party situation so some of you are going to decide to walk away this could be the other way around this could be you deciding to walk away we got healing yeah a lot of you are going to choose yourself some of you are going to end up with a leo i am seeing a leo in the future this leo could be a part of your healing process we got healing and discovery i'm seeing this leo helping you discover who you are this could be a Taurus coming in or a Gemini for some of you. For those of you dealing with a Taurus or a Gemini, I am seeing a lot of feelings, a lot of chemistry, a lot of emotion. If you're dealing with a Taurus or a Gemini, you're going to be having a conversation with them really soon. This could be tying a knot with fidelity. This could be making a commitment and kind of stamping it and making it known that you want to be loyal to this person. This could be a Pisces for some of you. There could be a Gemini or a Pisces wanting forgiveness from Aries right now. I am still doing five for five questions for Aries. The cash app is D E E F O N D E L. The email is there, findelegmail.com. You can check out my bio or description for more. Thank you.